Now we have the function of f is defined by f of x equal to ax plus b. x can, can be any real value. So x can, can take any values for this function. Now a and b are constant that we can see here, a and b. Now, it is given that f of 2 is 1 and f of 5 is 7. So let's find the values of a and b. So pretty easy. Use the given values over here to find that. So first part, let's use f of 2 is equal to 1, which means when the value of x is 2, the value of f will be 1. Replace. So that will be value of f is 1. x will be 2. So that will be 2a plus b. So let me, let's make b become the subject. You will have b will be 1 minus 2a. That will be my first equation. Now for this one, f of 5 is equal to 7. Now, which means when x equal to 5, the value of f is 7. Replace back, you will have uh, 7 is equal to uh, 5a plus b. Now, let's make b become, become the subject, so b will be 7 minus 5a. That will be my equation number 2. Okay, so let's replace. Here we have b, here we have b, obviously here we have two equations. We have two unknowns. We are trying to solve a simultaneous equation. So we have 1 minus 2a on one side equal to 7 minus 5a on the other side. Now let's send all the a to one side. So minus 2 plus 5 will be 3a. And that will be 7 minus 1 will be 6. a will be the value of 2. Now from this, let's find the value of b. b will be 1 minus 2a. That will be 1 minus 4. And that will be minus 3. From here, we can clearly see we have we are able to find the values of a and b. a will be 2 and b will be the value of minus 3. So which means the value of f of x or fx is equal to 2x minus 3. Simply a straight line. Now part 2, we have to solve the equation f f of x equal to 0. So pretty easy. Let's write this down. f f of x is what? It is simply f of f of x, which means that will be 2 f of x minus 3 equal to 0. Let's solve. So here we have 2 times f of x, which was seen to be 2x minus 3, minus 3 equal to 0. So let's try to simplify this. So you have 2x, so 2 times 2x minus 3. We send this over here becomes 3, and you will have 2x minus 3, that will be 1.5. Now 2x, that will be 4.5. x have to be 4.5 divided by 2. That will be 2.25. So this is your answer for the question in regards to function for f of x equal to ax plus b.